<laughs> Yumi chan, I've worked so hard. Think I've earned a little kiss? Actually, if you're free later, do you want to go get some tea? Huh? Huh? What? 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 I think I should be safe now. Man, those girls really don't know when to quit, do they? Guess I can't really blame them. Yuzuriha messed everything up pretty good. Anyway, guess I better start searching for another checkpoint. It's probably my best chance of finding Celica and getting out of here. But where do I even start? Ugh, man, I wish there was some obvious sort of... What is wrong with you? Must you be so noisy? What's wrong with me? What's wrong with you? There's no need to be so upset. Your short temperament is that of a child. You should be ashamed of yourself. Look, I'm not gonna take life advice from some girl who spends her life hanging upside down. Anyone would freak out if they ran into someone hanging from a tree like that. Actually, why are you hanging from a tree? Well, that's a foolish question. Isn't it obvious? I am trapped. Uh, and you still manage to sound condescending. Oh, do forgive me. I've been condescending to people all my life. Perhaps I don't know how to turn it off. Uh... Why does this feel so... familiar? Yay! Gold Princess! Her condescension's on another level! What the hell is that thing? Thing? How rude! I am a highly evolved life form that doesn't have to answer to the likes of you! Oh, just leave it be! Picking a fight with this man isn't going to get us out of this! Oh, but don't worry, Princess. You're equally beautiful upside down or right side up. No fair! Why do you get to grab all the loyalty points? Uh, can one of you just tell me what's going on? Oh, dear. I didn't mean to leave you out of the loop. My name is Nago. This little one is Guy, and... The noble lady you see before you is Rachel. She's a being of tremendous, fearful power. So watch your tone around her if you value your life. Ah! Oh, why did you do that to me, princess? What an idiot. You always say the most unnecessary things. Listen to me, boy. If you don't want to end up like this little bat here, I suggest you stay on the princess's good side. That's quite enough talk. You there, how long do you plan on standing there, doll-eyed? Huh? You talking to me? Yes. Who else? I sense an unpleasant energy coming from you, but I shall overlook that for now. So quit your daydreaming and help me. She's still on her high horse. <sighs> this girl's just like her. That high and mighty attitude is almost identical. Fine, fine. Down you go. We're saved! Thank you, boy. Uh, my dress has been sullied. How awful. You're welcome. Anyway... How'd you wind up in that tree in the first place? Are you truly so dense you haven't noticed? Noticed what? Stop beating around the bush and tell me! There are numerous traps set up in the area. Each one's so obvious that even you should have noticed them. If they're all so obvious, then how did you get trapped? A cup. A what? I was destroying the traps as I went along, and I made it all the way here. That's when I noticed a cup. It was a beautiful little teacup with an intricate, elaborate design. 
I thought it would be a shame if it were to be destroyed by a trap. With that concern, I hurried over to pick it up, and then... A rope snared her around the ankle and hung her from the tree like a tetherball. So you fell for the most obvious, ordinary trap possible. Was Ski's punishment not enough of a warning to watch your mouth around me? It seems this dog needs some discipline. What? I'm telling the truth, aren't I? Anyway, are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? I'm fine. My! It seems he's quite the gentleman. Give me a break. But man, traps, huh? Does that mean there's a checkpoint nearby? Exactamundo! Duh! Why are you like this? Allow me to explain. You have reached the Forest of Traps. As the name would imply, there are countless traps scattered throughout the area. Only the brave warriors who can avoid the traps and make it out of the forest will receive their precious, precious stamps. Hmm. Gotcha. So that's the game this time around. That's my game indeed. Okay, shall we get the ball rolling? What begins with a mysterious encounter between a man and a woman ends with a sea of traps. Can they escape the forest? Let's find out. Let the challenge begin! I don't think so. This is where it ends. Whoa! Damn it, what's going on now? Ah, I thought we finally had a man to stand against us. This is nothing more than a scrawny little boy. I'm not that scrawny. You guys are just huge. Way huge. Azrael, the mad dog. And I imagine that mountain of a man must be Waldstein. Indeed. We're the gatekeepers of this forest. The what now? Hey, 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 what are you two doing? You're not supposed to show up until later. Stick to the script. Just when they're about to make it out of the forest, the final trap blocks their path. Guys, come on, we've been over this. <laughs> Absurd. No trap or lure can compare to my body's might. Our agreement was supposed to let me devour whatever powerful prey came my way. The way I see it, we're just speeding the process along. Are they seriously fighting among themselves? And what's this about an agreement? Interesting. Naruto, once more you've proven that there's nothing but empty space between your ears. Listen, there's a reason the terms of our agreement were what they were. <laughs> it would be a shame to have our opportunity to fight formidable opponents stolen from us by mere traps. Which is why we destroyed all of the traps on our way here. That defeats the purpose of the traps! <laughs> now, small ones, the only snares you must escape are my claws, the bear traps, Azriel's fangs! If you desire your stamps, then strike us down! Otherwise, you're gonna make a fine meal. You don't see us as much of a threat, do you? Very well. I suppose I can play with you. Hey, hey, hold on. Are you serious about this? Of course. You're welcome to go cry in the corner if you're scared. You've got to be kidding. I'm not going to let you fight these guys on your own. All right, let's do this. Bring it the hell on! Ha! Now there stands a man! <laughs> this is gonna be delicious. Looks like it's out of my hands at this point. I'm leaving luck to heaven. Go on and do your own dang tag battle if you're gonna be like that. Get ready! Get ready! Can't escape from crossing fate. Fight! Ah. Get her, bitch. 
for such little things. I couldn't have said it better myself. You may be little more than a child, but you have some spine, young man. Ah! Those, those guys were just knocked out, but they're getting right back up like nothing happened. Are, are they vampires? Annoying is what they are. Oh, how fun. It seems we'll have to put them down again. And again, and again, and again, until they finally sur- Are you kidding me? There's no way I can keep this up. I can see the numbers and we've got no chance. Rachel, we have to run. Oh. Hmm? Where are you going, lad? Get back here. I'm not done eating yet. I don't care! Sorry, but we're getting out of this forest and there's not a damn thing you can do to stop us! I feel like I've been doing nothing but running since I arrived here. Hey, a stamp. It seems you've proven yourself worthy. I received one as well. Well, that's a relief. Don't tell me. You're not taking this stamp collecting nonsense seriously, are you? <laughs> Sorry about that. But it's not like I've got anything better to do around here. Don't apologize. I don't mind your simple honesty. Good luck with that. I don't need your luck. But thanks anyway. However, do take heed. Not everything you hear in this place can be trusted. Particularly what you hear from that voice. Voice? You mean system? Why not try thinking for yourself for once? It's not like your brain would be otherwise occupied during your idiotic stamp rally. You'll just take any chance to needle me, won't you? Fine, I'll figure all this out myself. I'm off to find my next stamp. Best of luck. Now I shall take my leave. Huh? Where are you... Farewell. Whoa! She disappeared. Rude and selfish every step of the way. They're so much alike, it's almost scary. I wonder what she's doing now. I better collect all the stamps and get back to her as fast as I can. Wait for me, Raquel. <laughs> 